Hi, Michelle Fontaine, Parole and on TV. The sun in northern Arizona can be brutal. Anything left outside will fade, lots of UV rays. So we decided to cover our RV. The RV cover we chose is made from ADCO, A-D-C-O. And we chose the Designer Series Moderate Climate. And the cost of the RV cover was about $250. And this is a 25 foot RV. Obviously we got the job done, but it did come with a few challenges. So here's the story of me covering that RV alone. Before cutting the seal wrap, the instructions recommend that you actually measure your RV because manufacturing specs can be off for about three feet. The instructions also recommend washing the RV and padding shop edges. They provide rain spout covers, which is kind of a neat little thing. Well, this is neat. It's a bag to put this in after. So this is the underneath. So I have to turn this over. Okay, I've turned it upside down. So now the front is up there. The back is here. This is the top of the cover. I know this is correct because the zipper is over there and that's what my door is. So now I'm going to be rolling it up so that when I climb the ladder, that will be ready to pull. Now I'm going to roll it up this way. This is going to be the front part. We'll be up the ladder first. There you go. Not too bad. When researching how to do this, I found a video that used the roll-up process, as I did. As you'll see, doing this alone, I did have problems on this first attempt. At this point, I was still pretty determined. I didn't want to go up on that roof again. This is the point where I felt it was dangerous and it was time to get down. After thinking about it overnight, I knew the wind was an issue and I also knew I needed to keep that roll together. So here's the next morning. Here we go with attempt number two. So I re-rolled it. Exterior side up, folded it in from the edges, and tied it every three or four feet. Also, this time, there's no wind. It's not even 7 a.m. <laughs> wow, so much easier. Confirming this is the front. It better be. <laughs> and all the rolling, you got twisted up a bit. So right now, I'm just untwisting the snake. And the fact that I did tie it really helped with that untwisting. You may not be able to tell, but I'm keeping at least two feet away from the edge. It's always comforting to see the zipper on the correct side. Wouldn't this be awful if I put it on upside down? Don't walk backwards without looking. There are all kinds of things up here. I'm kind of at the point, I think, it's time to get back on the ladder. Now I will get my step ladder out and pull down the side. Don't be fearful, just be careful. I wore sneakers. Not flip-flops. I sometimes trip with my sandals, so sneakers were the right shoe for me. You can do this. It's good to have someone within yelling distance, though. The tie-down part was super easy. ADCO provided these weights, which help you throw the tie-down 
under your RV to the other side. You snap it, tighten it, done. This is Michelle Fontaine for Rolling On TV, feeling very accomplished for putting her RV cover on.